I'm Julie Rust. On behalf of the Vail Ski Patrol, Mountain Information, Yellow Jackets, and Community Guest Services, I'd like to welcome you as a new employee to Vail Mountain. Hi, I'm Addie McCord and I'm the Ski Patrol Director at Beaver Creek. And I'd like to add my welcome to all of you new employees to the Vail Resorts team. At Vail and Beaver Creek, we take our fun seriously, and that means knowing the responsibility code. The first two rules are really basic. Know how to use our chairlifts before you get on them, and make sure your ski brakes are working or you got a leash on your snowboard. This next one is really the most important one. Stay in control. Don't go faster than your ability to stop. Live by that one. Next, the people ahead of you have the right of way. Doesn't matter if you think they're going too slowly or if they're turning erratically. It's your job to avoid them. Always stop where you're visible from above. Don't stop to rest under a breakover or you might get hit. When merging onto a trail or coming out of the trees, look uphill and yield to others. Read all signs and observe all warnings. Stay off of closed trails. The ropes are there for a reason, and if you cut a rope, you will lose your pass. If you're on a wide open run, go ahead, go a little bit faster, but if there's some traffic out there, please slow it down. Give the other people out there plenty of space. What you need to understand is that skier and rider safety is a big deal to us and to our guests. We created the Yellow Jacket program to educate and enforce the rules of the road, your responsibility code. We have a monitored run you can find listed on our grooming report in TVA Daily. The objective of the monitored run is to create a comfortable run for beginners, ski schools, and families. The Yellow Jacket monitored run is a study and respect for each other. So please, when you're on that run, more than ever, set the example. Vale and Beaver Creek have fantastic terrain parks and half pipes. Let's see what the folks at Burton have to say about terrain park etiquette. Freestyle terrain contains parks and pipes and all the features including jumps, hits, ramps, banks, fun boxes, jibs, rails, half pipes, quarter pipes, and other features. The orange oval is a symbol used by resorts to represent freestyle terrain. It is posted at the top of the terrain park or half pipe and in trail maps. The symbol is usually found with safety information about terrain park use, including Smart Style. Smart Style is all about safety and having the knowledge to enjoy your freedom and the freestyle terrain. The three main points of Smart Style include Look before you leap. Before getting into freestyle terrain, observe all signage and warnings. Use your first run as a warm up run and to familiarize yourself with the park layout and features. Easy Style It. Know your limits and ride within your ability. When starting out, look for small progression parks and features and then work your way up to medium or large parks and features. Respect gets respect. Respect the terrain and all others. One person on a feature at a time. Wait your turn and call your drop in. Always clear the landing area quickly. Respect all signs and stay off close features. Remember that respect is important both in the park and on the rest of the resort. So be smart when you're heading down the mountain, or to the lift, and save your best tricks for the park. My name is Sean White. I've been riding for Burton since I was about seven years old. I don't know, I just, uh, I've always worn a helmet. It just feels so good to wear one. I almost feel weird not wearing it. I think twice about hitting jumps and stuff. and. And I, I just wore them anyway, anyways because I had this, uh, this bad accident where a snowboard hit me in the head you know, and I, I got knocked out and I could have been dead if I wasn't wearing my helmet and so from then on I was like, I'm just going to wear it. As a Vail Resorts employee, you are held to a higher standard of responsibility when you're on the slopes, in uniform or not. As an employee, if you are contacted by Ski Patrol, Yellow Jackets, or any other mountain staff for a safety or behavior issue, your season pass privileges will be revoked. Maybe a week, maybe more. So please, whether you're out on the slopes having fun or you're working, just keep safety in mind. Take care of our guests as well as yourselves. <laughs>